right, this one's a little backwards. The last one we did before the night, it was like energetic, I'm excited. This is at the end of the weekend. I feel like I might have been a little more, a little more hype for what was to come. And now I'm a little bit more distraught and, and wrecked and just shot from what we did. Holy shit. We gotta talk about Sunday though. I got my slot, I'm two to six at Bottle Blonde. That's my shit, that's my zone. You're getting the party started, you get the early crowd who maybe has been there for a minute so they're already drunk, and then you get the little trickler inners who start to get drunk and you see them loosening up as you're playing shit and then they get into party mode and the party starts building by like four or five. You've got a nice juicy crowd that's ready to go. And then from five to six, that's when you hit la, 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 One at night, New York City, heard it going down. Friday night, midnight, Atlantic City, slash machines, ding, 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 when they ring off. Lock the doors, that's when ghosts just beat off. Sunday fun day, starting during the day, trying to make it to the end of the night. It's a different style of drinking. You can't just drink like normal. Sunday fun day drinking is like, you sip on a drink, you maybe take a shot from someone and like pretend to do it and fucking one of those, nah. Half, half the shot. That's, that's my go-to, that's my mood. I'll take half. These motherfuckers are pouring extreme shots anyways. Taking half is like taking a regular shot. You take half. So, I'm in the pocket, right? Make it to 10, it's my boy Fonz at heart. I go over there, it's early in the night, he's opening up, it's dope because you get to kick it outside of some like club shit, like, oh shit, yeah, what's up, bro, you know, it's like, oh, what's good, you get to actually talk, he was like, man, there's this, this girl who's new here, and she's just so sweet, like, don't you love that when you see new girls who come into the, the industry, and they're just so nice, and I'm like, yeah, I love it, but then I also... I've just watched so many girls get destroyed, eaten up, like these sweet girls that you know you're like, oh, you don't want to be here. You're like, don't, you don't want to be here. That young, spry, northwest suburban chick who was bartending at the carpeted bar with the dartboard in it, coming down to the city looking to make some more money, move up, gets caught up in the trap of champagne and cocaine and money and trips and lips and injections. They all slowly transform into the same creature, I'm trying to get to this weird Instacorn unigram picture person that they think exists but doesn't. Like, I don't even know. I just said a prayer in this situation. Oh, moving on, moving on. Fine. Heart, crushed it. The boys came through. Bottle Blonde was in the building. Let's go. It was lit, bro. At one point, I remember Fawn was talking about someone's birthday, and then this kid's rapping, Meek Mill, Dreams and Nightmares. He kind of killed it, bro. I'm not gonna lie. It was lit, bro. It was lit. I'm excited to be fucking back in the thick of it, baby. Sunday Fun Day Marathon Shift. What's up? Two to two. Holler at your boy. Check back with me. Make sure you leave a comment if you're on YouTube. Subscribe. Uh, Instagram, go over to YouTube. Hit subscribe. Help me help you to get to some more titties. That's all I'm saying. I know that's what you guys are here for. No one really wants to hear me talk and tell you about my day. You want to see the titties. I get it. Help me help you. You know what I'm saying? Drop a comment. Tag a friend who would like it. Share it with a buddy. Tell your girl to slide through and dump them out. Whatever it may be. Let's go, help me help you. Let's fucking do this shit, alright?